Hey guys, what's up? Today I will talk about surf. How to disguise heavy on the spin surf and dead no spin surf to confuse your opponent. Surf is very important part in table tennis. Everyone gets up to five serves in a game. So each surf plays important roles to the final result. I've made a lot of surf tutorials in my previous video. Please click on the playlist in my description box if you are interested in learning more surfs. So how could you surf legally and also disguise your surfs? Please stick to the video, you will find out shortly. First, quick review. I wanted to remind you the contact point on the ball when you serve heavy on the spin and dead no spin serve. For on the spin, you contact the ball at the bottom part. Contact the ball here, so the ball would rotate backwards like this. For the dead ball, you contact the ball in the middle or the top, a little bit top part. The ball doesn't rotate at all and it just moves forward like this. So how to disguise those two different serves? In this video, I will teach you four ways to achieve that. Stand sideways at your backhand corner and use your forehand serve. Because when you are in this position, your hand, your arm is behind your body it's better to discuss your serve. If you stand face forward and stand and use the forehand serve or backhand serve, your opponent could easily tell your movement and your stroke. If you want to serve a heavy on a swing ball, try to contact the ball on the left side of the racket here. So the ball could stay longer on the racket and generates more spin. If you want to serve that no spin ball, try to contact the ball on the middle or the right side of your racket. So the ball cannot generate a lot of spin. Wrist movement. When you serve a heavy on a spin ball, try to use your wrist movement like this in order to generate more spin and uh, try to keep your stroke move fast, faster so your opponent cannot notice that but for that no spin ball we don't use our wrist at all we just gen gently touch the ball and send the ball forward try to keep the strokes looks exactly the same when you serve the heavy on a spin and the dead no spin ball. So same standing position, same tossing position, and same movement when you contact the ball. The last, same ending position. Yeah, everything keeps the same. There are only three different things when you serve those two different serves. First, the contact point on the ball. On the spin, you serve on the, at the bottom part and the dead ball you serve middle or the top part and second contact point on the racket angle on the spin you serve on the left side of the ball of the racket and that no spin ball you serve middle or the right edge of the racket third wrist movement on the spin you use wrist movement when you contact the ball that no spin ball you don't use wrist
All right, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Surf requires a lot of practice. Try to practice the more often, and I'm sure you will master the surfs you want. Please leave your comments to share your thoughts about those two different surfs. And don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye bye.